Hey folks, it's Gary from Nova Scotia Act Fisher Outdoors. I'm out here on this uh, beautiful October day and I, I thought I'd just uh, do a little uh, short video on one of my uh, favorite new pieces of gear for 2020. Uh, you've seen it in a few of my videos if you've been following. Uh, but uh, it's the Dragoon Sabbat 2 stove. Uh, comes in this neat little carrying case. Really like that. Protects it. Let's see if I can get it open. Nice and compact, but has a fairly wide area to, to hold your stove. Also comes with a pot stand or a little stand. And, uh, I mean, backpacking, if I was just doing boiling meals, just boiling water, I'd probably take uh, a little titanium BRS stove or something like that. But uh, by and large, I do a lot of fishing on my outings or hunting, and I like to, uh, I usually carry a small frying pan. And uh, this creates a little wider base. So uh, I'm going to put in a few clips now of uh, uh, some of the uh, times I've used the stove uh, this season and then I'll bring you back and give you a few more of my final thoughts. There you have it, bacon and eggs on the third day of an extreme heat wave in the backcountry. There, my jambalaya is bubbling. Okay, so I'm going to just turn that down a little smidge. Okay, so uh, as you've seen, I've, I've cooked everything from eggs to pasta meals, uh, white sauces, uh, done a lot of fish fries with it, done a pash. It's just a great stove. Uh, it's a little heavier than your little titanium BRS's, which maybe uh, if, if weight means that much and you're not carrying a frying pan or something like that, uh, you might use that backpacking. But this stove, great base. Uh, this pot doesn't even, I mean, there's still half inch or more on each side that hangs out. So uh, it can take a bigger pot and be quite stable. Uh, I really like that... Uh, 
it uh, does really well with uh, simmering. You have good temperature control. You can jack it right up or you can tone it right down so you're not burning meals, particularly in titanium uh, pots, uh, which can burn quite easily. Uh, so uh, really, the, I couldn't ask for a better stove. It's become my go-to. Uh, I expect maybe even in the winter it will come with me some. Uh, just couldn't be happier. The compactness of it, the carrying case, the wideness of the uh, stand, so the, the pot stand so I can uh, easily put on a uh, frying pan and not have to worry about it tipping over. Uh, I expect it will stay with me for quite some time to come. So anyway, I I urge you to check out Dragoon Sabbat 2 stove. I've, I'll provide a link in the description. Uh, you can usually find it on Amazon, certainly on Amazon Canada and uh, Amazon in the States. But it's a great little stove, uh, perfect for my needs, good temperature control, well built, uh, great little carrying case. I mean, you can discard that if you don't want to take it with you for uh, a little less weight. But uh, I'm very happy with it, and I uh, used it lots this summer. Uh, it's never failed me, never came close to failing me. So uh, give it a ch check them out, and uh, I don't think you'll be disappointed. If you like getting out in the woods and frying up some meals, or maybe doing some gourmet stuff where you want to simmer, this is the stove for you. It looks like I think we're coming to a boil already. Yep. So until next time, I'm Gary from Nova Scotia Yak Fisher Outdoors. Get out in the woods, get yourself a little portable stove, and uh, cook some meals while you're out in the woods. It's a great way to enjoy the outdoors. Take care, all. Bye bye. All right, where's my? I didn't have the foresight to bring my coffee cup out yet. I guess I gotta get that. All right.